I'm Scott Graham. I'm the Artistic Director of Frantic Assembly. I'm co-directing Things Know To Be True. I'm Jordi Brookman. Uh, I'm the Artistic Director of State Theatre Company of South Australia. Things I Know To Be True is a brand new play by the Australian playwright Andrew Bevel. It's been in development for three years in a collaboration between Frantic Assembly and State Theatre Company. Um, and it's, yeah, it's developed over that time into a really beautifully complex plotted um, family drama essentially looking at generational tension and I guess the dreams that different generations have been sold. But essentially it is a family drama yeah. and despite the crisis, despite the challenges at the heart of it, it's, it's about love and about the bonds and pressures and challenges that that can bring to a family. It's what one generation's dream was and what it became. And that's what we wanted to look at, how that challenges and redefines the family relationship as they go through that, uh, that growing awareness. What Andrew has done is he's created this incredibly intimate piece of drama that resonates in a really, really universal way. What I find exciting about this, this project is uh, being in a room with another, another theatre maker, what I can learn from that and what we can learn together, mm. finding out things that we didn't know yet. I, I've always thought that collaboration isn't about coming into a room and showing somebody else what you know, it's about discovering what neither of you knew yet. Scott bringing his methodology into the show has been incredibly important. You know, Scott has encouraged an incredibly precise sense of physicality. So we, we create the, we, we need to create these scenes that it's like two actors having a high tensile wire strung between them and every movement is considered and wrought and highly meaningful. What I want is, is an audience to engage with the work with their hearts and with their heads. I want them to leave still thinking about this work and how it reflects their lives. I think we'll be doing our jobs if they come out of it having laughed a bit, cried a bit, gasped occasionally and hopefully spent large amounts of the evening and the drive home thinking about their own family and their place within their family and, and then, you know, that I think ultimately ripples out and you think about how you fit into your community and, and, and your world.